This one is underway. Andy Orton and Triple H one-on-one -on -one for the WWE Championship. The special stipulation is that the WWE title will change hands on a disqualification. Well, that's going to work again. At 24 years of age, Orton... made history by becoming the youngest world heavyweight champion of all time. The skills that this young man has are rarely, if ever, seen. I don't see any redeeming qualities there. Randy Orton may not always be a likable guy, but there is no denying the young man has talent. You cannot deny Orton's ability in the ring. Triple H is not a man that makes idle promises. Triple H has talked about destroying Randy Orton, and that is a little unsettling. Oh, these men are going at it tooth and nail here. But again, Triple H cannot lose control. If he's disqualified, he loses the WWE Championship. Triple H is not only going to have to fight Randy Orton, but also the game's very nature. Oh, and that one got it. do King you seen this man Randy Orton kick your mother-in-law in the head kick your brother-in-law in the head DDT no one does that move better this could be it the game could be over thanks to Triple H that's it. It's nothing new, but Triple H is getting inside the head of his opponent here. Look at him unloading with the Dez Press. Look at the strength behind those strikes. Oh, baby, that was harsh. Hope we can get up after that one. He's really going for it now. Another one. No, not again. Cerebral assassin. Oh. The cerebral assassin preparing his foe for the ultimate demise. Oh, what a pedigree. That's it. stage of Wrestlemania tonight. Be careful how far you back somebody into a corner, especially if that somebody is named Triple H.